All right, good morning, everyone. Louis Porcelain, Man Over Market, and today is uh, May 4th, and this is the E-mini uh, morning call. Well, the market's trading higher again after Friday. This is a day session uh, profile, day session only, no overnight action. And as you can see, uh, we came down, we tested this. You know, we didn't make a new low here, but during the day, uh, we traded below the 20-day uh, value area low, which is 2083.60. All right, and then, um, uh, you know, we had a, that that was the day before, and then Friday, uh, uh, we, you know, we had two lower closes on a day level, and then now we're back uh, on Friday, we had our value area high, our low trade higher, we had our mode trade higher, and we had our value area high trade higher, and uh, we are now just above the 20-day mode, which is 2099. Uh, 13 basically right here 29913 looking like uh, there's a big support area now at 2088 and um, the market looks like it wants to go higher uh, here's the overnight action so overnight action and the spoos look like uh, looks like an unfinished top at 2108 half We've got uh, a bottom at 2097.75, so it looks like that's a basically a thousand point range. Um, you know, these are the kind of things you take a look at this low. You know, on Friday, it, it's just like you know the whole day we're waiting for that to get completed and it didn't, and we just keep moving up. We just keep moving up. All right. So uh, you know, on the way up, um, you know, we, we're looking at the 2012 half. All right. And then uh, ultimately we got 2019 uh, along the way, but we're gonna. I think we're gonna go uh, 2010, 12, uh, 1210. You take a look at this high volume area here. Here's an old mode at uh, 2011 half, and then you have 2012 half, and then ultimately uh, you know we got another volume here at 12, 6, 2116. And I think the market is just creeping up. All right, um, on the downside. Uh, You know, I like this. You know, the, I like this. Uh, we've got a big support area right in here. Let's go. I'm sorry, I took the chart away, but uh, uh, high volume overnight right in this area here. So 20.99 half, up to 21 even. Okay, and then uh, you know we talked about then as Pat and his. Uh, 2088 is a now big support area right in here. Filled in these single prints, took back all this stuff that was, uh, you know, bothering me down below. Not all of it, but most of it. And, uh, you know, and big support at 2088. All right. Take a look at, on, a, on, a, on a day chart. Let me make this smaller. All right. So... This is this is what we're talking about. This little wedge in here that uh, you know, you know, we from 2081, or actually 2082, up to here, this uh, 2089. Now this is where it kind of broke out from, and now we've tested it twice, and we've had a higher close, and we're working on another higher close today. All right, so that's that's what it looks like in a bar chart, on a daily, four hour. Um, once again, you look at those Keltner four hour uh, chart. Um, got into the oversold area, kind of consolidated above here, and now, boom, we kept moving up, and now we're getting in this area. Uh, the pivot, 2019 and a quarter, 2119 and a quarter on a four-hour basis. So that's what we're looking for uh, on the S&Ps today. Uh, let's look at the, um, the chart for the day, okay, showing... Uh, the top of value at 2105, 2099 will be our bull bear zone. And then, so we're going to be opening up uh, above value. Our five minute pivot right here at 2104, let's call it half. Uh, we've got the sisters all up above their five minute pivot. Okay, so uh, market looking strong. NASDAQ, NASDAQ up 13, Russell up one, Dow up 47, and we're up 46. All right. Um, the bottom bottom of value is uh, 
down here at 2089 half and then the top of our middle from Friday was uh, 2093 half 2093 half here's the blue zone remember by 930 I'll get you a new middle okay all right uh, that's what we got on S&P's uh, let me bring in gold here I'll tell you what gold uh, you know is rallying but it came down here and made a low 1171 we've got a bull bear zone 1180 uh, 1174.90 is the top of value point of control 1171 and the bottom of value down there at 1169 so um, you know what uh, gold has made a retreat from the t top of the high last week of 1215 uh, and that's off like 40 bucks and uh, the market looks like um, it's stabilizing because they think there's more stability in the world uh oh here, you know, here it comes. Been looking for this. As I put out this morning, I thought bonds were trading um, uh, like the Fed said they were going to raise rates or it's trading like there's going to be a sneak rate cut. Got the bull bear zone at 157.01, top of value at 157.21, point of control at 157.15. Market right now is trading above value, off the highs at the uh, uh, made a high up here at a 158 let's see if we're going to get back into that 160 area um so and last but not least we got oil on the move again on the upside and uh trading on the top of value 59.34 bull bear zone line and it's going to be 59.11 58.79 is a point of control and then 56.68 so uh oil is uh you know, moving towards that $60 area. I had stated earlier this year that I thought that gold would trade between $70 and $30 this year. So, uh, you know, we're getting a retracement in oil right now. All right. Uh, Louis Borslino, Man Over Market. Have a good trading day, and we'll talk to you soon. See us on Top Step. Follow us on Twitter. Thank you. Bye.